No, this is not a review. This is my entire toy haul as of May, but I'm sorry I didn't get a chance to get this toy haul done until June. It took a long time for my figures to come in the mail and stuff, but I've been waiting for them to come in the mail. And I'm sorry about any delays I may have had on making the video. But, yeah, we had some money issues for a while, so it took me, my mom a while to, you know what I mean, let me have my money for my budget. So, now that I had my money for my budget, I got all this great stuff. Doesn't mean I wasn't scoring stuff for free as well, but I'm sorry about any delays here on the channel, but we had to pay bills here at my house. It's a thing when you live in a house like this. We gotta pay bills, first and foremost. But we're hoping to get back on track next week. But this was for the 15th of May, so sorry about this being overdue. Apology to all my fans. But today, we'll be showing off everything I got here. First on the list, we got this uh, horse I scored for free. Someone threw him out in such great shape. All I did was wash him up and cleaned him up as good as new. Definitely going on the review bucket list for sure. With the other loose figures, of course. We got this little alien dude. Oh man, he's just freaky looking. I will review him and he's a finger puppet. So, he'll be going on my monster shelf. Next, we got a Magic Mixie, which I scored for free. This is so cool, and it makes noise. I'm going to show you what it does when it got batteries in it, because I do got some batteries with it, but I just keep them loose so, so it doesn't run out of juice. Take a look. Yeah, it lights up and makes noise. That, that is cool. I have to leave a battery loose out of it, or I risk losing battery power, so it will be something I will be reviewing. So it's going in the random bin for sure. Next, we have another one of my custom Bionicles. This was one I originally customized just as of this week. This is my custom Dark Hunter. Yeah. I customized him yet again. The same figure, but with a new body and a new design. He just looked so cool. Definitely going to be reviewing him. Okay. Next, we got some more Transformers for the review bucket list. We got Cybertron Battler, Bumblebee. Yep, Bumblebee in the house. So I got my second Cybertron Battler. Definitely going to be reviewing him on the channel. Next, we got Legacy. Sorry, all right, if I pause for a moment. We have Legacy Tarantulas based on the Beast Wars Predacon Tarantulas. And this is the best variant of this character that I own now. Definitely look forward to reviewing him on channel. So he'll be reviewed on the bucket list. For sure. Next, we got the last 1980s Ninja Turtle I was needing to hunt down to complete the set. It's Michelangelo. So I finally have the whole set to review here on the channel. And this is the 2022 re-release set. First and next, we got the Castle... Gray Skull playset from the new Netflix He Man series, Masters of the Universe. And a couple more figures we're going to be reviewing here on my channel. If you enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed making it and are going to look forward to some of the stuff I'm going to review, then please do me a favor. Make sure to like, make sure to comment, and don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this. And this is Eddie Hill, moving on and rock on and rock out YouTube land.